it's another beautiful day in Texas. <laughs> One more cloudy, rainy day. But uh, we're not gonna let that stop us. We're still gonna go exploring. And today we're nope. gonna check out the Mission Trail here in San Antonio and uh, go and see at least a few of the missions. But we're gonna start with the Visitor Center to learn what it's all about. That's right. And we're gonna take you with us. As always. I bet that totally surprised you. Let's go. <laughs> In the 1700s, Franciscan missionaries established six missions along the San Antonio River. Five missions survive, four are active parishes. Steve inside the Indian quarters, where they had their converts. The point of the missions was to convert people to Catholicism. So this is the mission San Jose, one of the few missions we'll be seeing. And the point of the mission was for Spanish um, Franciscan monks to come over and convert the native people into Catholic tax-paying citizens for Spain. And so you have quarters for the native people behind us, and then the mission itself and daily life revolved around prayer and work and um, learning languages. They had to learn Spanish and Latin. Very interesting. What's going on in there, Courtney? There's a kind of an interesting wooden spiral staircase. On to the second mission of our tour. Paintings on the walls were done in 1756 when the con when the uh, mission was completed, and they had they did some restoration in 1998, so you could actually see them again. The colors are really bright. You tend to have two types of people when you go to places like this, like museums or whatever. You have the people, you have the readers who like to stop at each station, read and learn, and then you have people like me who don't care and just want to see pretty things. <laughs> you you're a reader. I'm in between, yeah. We started here and came up here. We're gonna head to the Alamo next. Well, the Alamo is that way, but it's also downtown San Antonio. So you know what that means. Parking is a cluster. So we just found a public parking lot. We're gonna pay and walk. Oh, wow. The minimum was five hours for 20 bucks. And we're gonna be here for 45 minutes, maybe an hour. We're not paying 20 bucks for an hour to park. No. So we're gonna try to find street parking. If we can't, we're gonna say, screw it. We're gonna do the Alamo tomorrow when we're back down here anyway to do the river walk. And then we will pay 20 bucks for five hours. Cause, cause we'll we will be stay here five hours. <laughs> so let's go see what we can find. Apparently we just found hour long parking for 30 cents. An hour and 27 minutes for 50 cents. That is what I'm talking about. Yes. Yes. I think we have some ruins here. So this is in 1785, it was rebuilt. 1785. I get it. 
Are you going to tell us something interesting about the Alamo? Well, I didn't really know much about it, but it was a pivotal place for one of the major battles of the Mexican Revolution. Um, and the Texas rebels took over the Alamo and actually protected like both Mexican settlers and Texas settlers inside from the Mexican army. And it actually inspired a lot of people to join the Texan army um, and defeat the Mexican army. So, very interesting. Hello, buddy. Fish in the irrigation. isn't really an impressive looker, I guess, like the other ones we've seen where they're really dramatic. This one's a little bit more spread out, lots of like green, green foliage and vegetation and things like that. So it's, uh, it's different and it's right downtown. So you also have the city element going on here. They're hoping for food. Naturally. Just like Patty, they're always hoping for food. And naturally, you have to have a gift shop to get some money from these tourists. We're done. At least for now. That concludes our small part of the mission trail. We went to three of the five missions. We didn't go to the southern two, but that's okay. Ended with the Alamo, which that's right. seems appropriate because we did find parking. Um, <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I think now we're gonna head back to girls before we go up to Northern San Antonio to do our first Texas meetup tonight. That'll Can't be wait. fun. Yes. It's gonna be a long trip though, but it'll be fun. It'll be fun. All right, let's go. And we have returned to the truck. Here's Charlie and the girls. Nice welcome home. As always. <laughs> Hello! Hello, puppies! Mm. Hello, puppies! Puppies! Yes! Oh, Patty almost fell off the couch. Careful! Boy, that worked really well. That was an awesome meetup. Thank you to everyone who came and met up with us at the Hoppy Monk in San Antonio. We had such a blast talking to everybody. The time just ran away from us. All of a sudden, it was like 6.30. My goodness. My goodness. And Penny is very impressed with this whole thing. <laughs> we talked about dogs. We talked about our being. We talked about peeing. <laughs> we did. All sorts of our being topics. So thanks again, guys. It was wonderful. Yes, it was. And hopefully you had fun too. I hope so. We'll see you at the next meetup. Yeah, or some some of you maybe. Somebody did at the next meetup in... Austin, we're gonna do another meetup. It's amazing how often our paths cross as, as our viewers. It's so. true. So I think that's it for this video. Tomorrow we're going to go and get some amazing barbecue from what I've heard. Oh, hey. Penny got excited. Hey, hey. Amazing barbecue for lunch from what I've hey. heard after the gym. And then we're gonna go do the river walk tomorrow night and check right. that out. Hopefully the weather's a little nicer. So we will take you along. Yes, we will.
But for now, until next time. Bye guys. See ya. Crazy puppies. Who are the crazy puppies? Who are the oh no, not you. Oh, oh. Who's crazy? Patty's crazy. She's like, is that food? No. Patty. Camera's not food. Patty. Oh, I love you too.